Hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome to another Nerdy Dummies. I got many requests from you guys to make something Star Trek themed. I'm super excited for the new movie and I am a huge Star Trek fan. Today we are going to be making three different recipes from scratch to represent the different Star Trek uniforms. The blue, the yellow, and the red. Let's get started. The first recipe that we're going to be making is a vanilla cupcake and we're going to be decorating it for the yellow uniform, the command uniform, the things you will need will be one cup of all-purpose flour, three-fourths cup of sugar, half a cup of milk, two eggs, one-fourth teaspoon of almond extract, quarter teaspoon of salt, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder, half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and half a stick of butter. And then you will also need a cupcake core. This is like an apple core, you guys, if you've ever cored an apple. I've got three cupcake trays and a bunch of black cupcake liners. Now let's put it all together. The first thing that we're gonna do is whisk together our dry ingredients in this bowl until it's well combined. We're gonna add our flour, baking powder, and salt. And whisk together. I just placed my dry ingredients off to the side and now I'm gonna cream together my butter and sugar. I'm gonna use a hand mixer, mix it together until it's light and fluffy. We're gonna add our eggs first, one at a time. You're gonna add the egg, mix it up, scrape the bowl down with your spatula, and then add your second egg. Mix it up and scrape down with the spatula. Then add both extracts. We got our vanilla and almond and mix it up one more time till well combined. Now we're gonna mix in our dry ingredients and our milk. I'm gonna start with dry ingredients and it's gonna go three parts dry, two parts milk. Dry, milk. Dry, milk, dry. And mixing up in between. Our vanilla cupcake batter is ready. This recipe makes 12 cupcakes, so you're gonna need all of it. Over here, I've got our cupcake tray and I've lined them with our little cupcake liners. And now we're gonna fill each one of them about two thirds full. I'm using a little ice cream scoop just to make it a little easier. Oh, but I'm still messy. On the Enterprise, I'm used to my food replicator. You're gonna heat your oven to 350 degrees and bake for about 18 to 20 minutes. The second recipe that we're gonna be making is a chocolate cupcake recipe for our red uniform. The things you will need will be 3 fourths cup plus two tablespoons of all-purpose flour, 3 fourths cup sugar, half a cup of cocoa powder, half a cup of milk, half a cup of water, quarter cup of oil, one egg, one teaspoon of baking powder, 3 fourths teaspoon of baking soda, and half a teaspoon of salt. The first thing that you're gonna do to make this recipe is the same before. We are gonna whisk together our dry ingredients ingredients into a bowl and mix them up until they're well combined. <laughs> oh yeah, that's chocolate cupcake. And now I'm gonna mix together my wet ingredients. Gonna add my egg first. Not the shell, we don't want the. Then you can add your oil, water, and milk and whisk together one more time. Done whisking that and now we're gonna combine our wet ingredients into our dry. We can pour it in all at once, then mix together until well combined. You guys know the drill, just get it going. Same as before, our chocolate batter is ready and this batter makes exactly 12 cupcakes. We've got our cupcake tray over here. Taking an ice cream scoop just to make it easier, but you're gonna fill it two thirds full. Had just enough batter once again to make 12 delicious chocolate cupcakes. We're gonna heat the oven to 350 and bake for 18 to 20 minutes. The final cupcake recipe that we're gonna make is a blueberry cupcake to be decorated like the Star Trek blue uniforms. The things you will need will be one and a quarter cup of all-purpose flour, three eggs, we're gonna be using two eggs and one egg yolk, 10 tablespoons of sugar, half a cup of melted butter, quarter cup of sour cream, two teaspoons of baking powder, a pinch of salt, and three drops of royal blue gel color. Then to make our blueberry compote, which is an ingredient in our cake, two cups of frozen blueberries, half a cup of sugar, quarter teaspoon of cinnamon, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. The first thing that we're gonna do is take our blueberries, sugar, cinnamon and salt over to the stove. Mix your blueberries, sugar, cinnamon, and salt into a small sauce pot. Turn the heat to medium and cook for 15 to 20 minutes, stirring frequently. Then turn off the heat and set aside to cool. Our compote is cooling off to the side. Next, we are gonna combine our eggs and sugar and mix them together. We are gonna be combining two full eggs and one yolk. Now add the sugar and whisk together. Ooh, that looks good. 
good time to add our dry ingredients. We're gonna add our flour, baking powder, and salt. We'll whisk again until well combined. I'm gonna switch to a little rubber spatula and we're gonna fold in the rest of our remaining ingredients. We've got our blueberry compote. Be very careful of the stains. I know from experience. Sour cream and melted butter. Go down the middle, under and around. Down the middle, under and around. You guys, this smells so good. To give it a pop of color, I'm gonna add a few drops of blue food coloring. This is totally optional, you don't need to do this. I just want it to pop. Blueberry batter is ready. We've got our cupcake tray lined with our little cupcake liners again. And we're gonna scoop them with another ice cream scoop, two thirds full. Our blueberry cupcakes are ready to bake. Same as before, you're gonna heat your oven to 350 degrees and bake for about 18 to 20 minutes. While our cupcakes are baking and cooling, we are gonna make the cupcake fillings. I've laid out the three different fillings that we're gonna use today. For our vanilla cupcakes, we're gonna be using lemon curd, which I've got right here. Then for our chocolate cupcakes, we're gonna be making strawberry ganache. We have some strawberry jam, one cup of chocolate chips, and one cup of cream. Then for our blueberry cupcakes, we're gonna be making vanilla pudding. We've got three cups of milk and one box of pudding. Since our lemon curd is good to go, we are gonna start by making our strawberry ganache. To make our ganache, the first thing that we're gonna do is pour cream into the sauce pot and turn the heat to medium. Heat to a scald. You'll know that it's scalding when little bubbles start to form all around the edge of the pot. Once scalding, turn off the heat and pour over your chocolate chips. Let the mixture sit for three to five minutes and then stir together until smooth. Lastly, set it in the fridge to chill. We made our ganache, we let it chill in the fridge and now we are gonna add our jam. It's gonna be a two to one ratio. We have one cup of ganache, so we're gonna need half a cup of jam. I've got a spatula and I'm just gonna mix it together till it's well combined. For our vanilla pudding filling, it is very easy. We are just gonna combine our pudding mix with our milk into a bowl. Whisk together until it's smooth and lump free. Then we're gonna set it into the fridge to firm and set. Takes about mm, 10 minutes. Once your cupcakes have baked and had plenty of time to cool, now we are going to core them. You're gonna take a cupcake and a little core and we're gonna press it down about 80% of the way. So just press it down and twist, and then pull it out. If it won't come out easily, I've got a little poker. Just pop it out. Then we're gonna do this to the rest of our cupcakes. Cupcakes are cored. Now we're gonna fill them. I'm gonna start with vanilla. I've bagged the lemon curd into a plastic baggie with a number 12 tip. We're gonna fill it right to the top, but don't overfill. Next, we are gonna fill our chocolate cupcakes with our strawberry ganache. Again, I've put it into a plastic baggie with a number 12 tip. Last but not least, we're gonna fill our blueberry cupcake. We've got our vanilla pudding filling in a plastic baggie with again a number 12 tip. To top and decorate we have some fresh blueberries, strawberries, and raspberries, and then buttercream frosting which I put into plastic baggies and dyed yellow, red, and blue. The first thing that we're gonna do is add some toppings. I'm gonna start with our vanilla and I'm just gonna put a dab of frosting right here so that our raspberries will stick. Now I'm gonna add three raspberries, stick them together in the center. Got my buttercream frosting, and now I'm gonna frost them all the way around. I want them to look like they're three layers. So we're gonna go one, two, three, boop. Next, our chocolate cupcakes. I'm gonna bring them over here and take our fresh strawberries. Just place them right on here. With our red buttercream frosting, we are going to again frost three layers around the strawberry. All that's left now are our blueberry cupcakes. I'm gonna take a dab of buttercream frosting, put it right at the top, bloop, and stick on three to four blueberries. Then frost it just like our other cupcakes. Our Star Trek cupcakes are assembled and they're custom and they're frosted and they are awesome. They look like the different uniform colors, but I wanted to make them a little extra special. They were missing this insignia. So we're gonna roll out a little bit of fondant and make little insignias and place them on the front of our cupcakes. I've got a little marshmallow fondant that I've dyed gray and yellow. You just need a little bit, you don't need a lot. Roll it flat. I've got a little leaf shaped cookie cutter. It's very small. I'm gonna cut out a bunch of these. Now using the same cookie cutter, we're gonna use the top of it and we're gonna cut out a little nook from the bottom and we're gonna offset 
center it just a little bit because that's what the Star Trek insignia looks like. For a little extra fun, I'm going to be adding silver disco dust to the top of these. Take a little baking brush and just lightly coating it with a little bit of shimmer. This kind of gives it the metallic look that it has on the shell. For the base of our insignia, I'm just going to pinch off little yellow pieces and roll little balls. Then I'm just going to press it flat with my thumb, put a little gold disco dust on top, and then stick them together. Ding. Final step, we're going to place our insignias onto our cupcakes. The insignias are over here on the left side of the uniform. Do you row to the bridge. These cupcakes are almost done. Here we go, just stick them right there. Ta-da! Here are the Star Trek themed cupcakes that we made today. We decorated them to look like the different uniform colors and each color has a custom recipe with fresh fruit. Yum, 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 yum. A big thank you to you guys for suggesting something Star Trek. I absolutely love Star Trek. I'm so excited for the movie. And I'll be taking lots of pictures of these cupcakes and posting them on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram. And if you guys made any Star Trek treats or these treats, please take a picture and send it to me. I love seeing your baking creations. I just get a big kick out of it. It makes my day. And if you have any other ideas for any other nerdy nummies, please let me know. Leave me a comment down below and I will do my best to make it happen. Thanks so much you guys. Bye bye and live long and prosper.